Hello everybody, good morning. Andrea Majeski here with Dental Owl Mobile Hygiene. So lately I've been seeing a lot of kids. I think it's because they had a PD day last Friday and there was a snow day a couple weeks ago already. So I have been seeing a lot of kids lately. And the one common question that a lot of parents are having is why does my, my kid clench or grind their teeth at night because it does sound awful like you can literally hear them you know like grinding away at their teeth at night and the good news is is that hopefully it will not last so we see this often like 99 percent of, of um, cases is that kids do grind their teeth at night so i will kind of tell you guys why and how but they will grow out of it um only once have i seen a four-year-old where they were actually grinding so much that their teeth were starting to wear away and even if they're primary teeth so even if they're baby teeth all of that pressure that is being put on onto their primary teeth might be affecting the permanent teeth underneath it. But at that age, probably not, but it's just something that, that we do watch out for. But even having that said, if a four-year-old is clenching their teeth at, at night and that is happening, we can't make them a night guard how we, how we normally would for adults because they can't wear something like that in their mouth and their mouth is changing so much that you don't want them to have something in their mouth to kind of stop those normal changes from happening. You know, imagine if they had something put in their mouth all day long or all night long, they're not sort of, um, their, their mouth isn't developing as it should. So you don't want to do that. But typically kids do grow out of it. Um, why they're clenching and grinding, you know, we don't we don't really know but it could just be because they're you know they're anxious about something they're stressed about something they might need to do something at night to kind of relax them a little bit more um or they it's just their body's way of doing it at night because it's not something that they're doing on purpose if you go to a child and say well stop doing that they're not knowing what they're doing they're typically doing it when they're fast asleep. So you can't tell them to stop because they're not doing it on purpose. So yes, it sounds awful. You might be concerned, but there's not much you can actually do about it. And I've only seen it once in my 14 years experience where the child was grinding so much, their teeth were being worn down. So, but even having that said, there are always things we can do we can put like a composite over top of those areas so that when they are clenching and grinding at night, they're grinding on onto the composite and not their enamel. So that's something that I believe we did do for that patient. Um, but that's not the normal cases. Typically it does happen, but the kids do grow out of it. They can do it as, as early as, I've seen it as early as three even into their teenage years. Now, even as a teenager, they will likely grow out of it. We don't typically make a night guard for anybody until they're 18, 19, because your mouth is still changing, teeth are, are still moving. Even at the age of 17, your wisdom teeth are starting to come through, but things are still changing you don't stop, um, stop growing um, mouth-wise until you're about 21, 22, sometimes even 23 for some patients. So unless they really need the night guard, we typically wait until at least the age of 18. But I don't see a lot of teenagers doing it. It's more college students because they're they're nervous, they're anxious, they're stressed out. But if you are clenching your, 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 your teeth at night, as an adult, you have to have a night guard made. Um, it just helps to prevent more wear and other problems on the teeth. But as a child, there's not much you can do, but just wait and see, and they will grow out of it. So do not be alarmed if you do see that. Um, you can't make a night guard for a child because their mouth 
is still developing. So it just wouldn't really do too much good. So I hope this helped. If you guys have any questions, please let me know. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.